guys, I'm Sahala and we are on Taste With Me. So for today, I'm going to be making tuna cupcakes. You may think it's weird, but it's actually very, very tasty. It's very simple, easy, one bowl, and I'll walk you guys through that. So the things we will need is salt, pepper, milk, three eggs, one can of tuna, one and a half cups of all-purpose flour, half a teaspoon of garlic paste and half a teaspoon of garlic ginger paste a bit of spring onion and coriander grated cheese i'm using mozzarella 200 grams and onion green pepper um, olives and some tomatoes we will also need two tablespoons of melted butter three tablespoons of mayonnaise oregano to taste two teaspoons of uh, baking powder and half a teaspoon of baking soda. Oh, and don't forget your cupcake tray and your cupcake liners. So the onion, the pepper and the tomatoes and the olives are all to taste. I used one onion, half a green pepper, one tomato and eight olives. So it's all to taste. So I'm going to put this in the bowl, first thing. Give it a, give it a quick mix. So one thing that I like to do, every time I add something, I try to put the amount of salt needed for that. Just so at the end I don't end up putting too much. So I'm going to put the amount of salt I think I will need for this. Give it a mix. Okay. So now, don't forget also your spring onions and your coriander. Now we add in three eggs. Our butter. Our mayonnaise. garlic and ginger um, I also put in my oregano it's fine tuna I'm using tuna if you feel like you want to use chicken you boil the chicken and then or cook it however you want and you can use it so a bit more salt Pepper. Okay, I'll give it a quick stir and I'll show you how it looks. Now we add in the flour. And we're also going to be adding the milk. So I don't know the right quantity of the milk. That's why we're just going to eyeball it. And it should look like a cupcake batter. I'll need more. I think I'll probably need more, so I'll need to go get. Okay, I will need more milk. Just a minute. Right, I've got more milk. So, keep mixing. I thought I needed a hand whisk, but I don't. I think I'll need a bit more. Okay, I think this is perfect. Actually, no, it is perfect. So now we put in all of our cheese.
When you add the cheese, maybe you'll need to add a bit more milk, in my case. I can put all of the milk. So now, a bit more salt. Pepper. And finally, your baking powder and baking soda. Give it a mix. And we're done. How easy was that? So now I'm going to line my cupcake trays and then we're going to fill this and put it in the oven. Got to tell you I preheated my oven to 180. So I've already filled my cupcake trays. I filled them around 3 quarter full because they will grow. And I also added a little olive on the top. So now we're going to put these in the oven. I think they take around 20 minutes. But you can just put a toothpick in the center and you can check. And I'll show you how it looks. So guys, here they are, my cupcakes. This is how they look. You see they're a bit golden brown at the top. And also, another thing is, I forgot to tell you that you need to put a bit of butt, uh, spray on the liners. Guys, I hope you liked this video. Subscribe to my channel and let me know in the comments what you think. And um, till next time.